Hey everybody, it's me Brad Lokley. Uh, I wanted to do a quick instructional video uh, for all of you out there who are avocado fans, but particularly for my good friend Shoshana Bean, who if any of you caught her amazing Tuesday night uh, virtual standards concert on stage it last night, you noticed that her hand was all wonky because she was apparently cutting an avocado and sliced her hand open and needed seven stitches. And as we know, avocado injuries are on the rise in America because unfortunately a lot of you, and I say this with love, are idiots. Uh, sorry Shoshana, but come on girl. Um, my best guess is it's because a lot of you are going at your avocados like this, which is insane. Um, I'm going to show you uh, the way I slice avocados. I have sliced literally tens of thousands of avocados. I've never even nicked my finger, okay? And I'm gonna show you a couple different variations on how I do it. All right, kids, so there's your avocado. Put it on the cutting board, see? Right on the cutting board. You're gonna keep your hand like this. See how I don't put my fingers like that? That's how you cut fingers. If you keep your fingers like that, which is how chefs teach you how to do it. You keep your fingers flat and you keep your thumb touching the back of that one. It means no matter what you do, you're never gonna be able to cut yourself. You make an initial cut in, right? Just like that. Remove the knife, turn it around, follow that same line all the way around. She pops right out. Now you've got the avocado. Now there's two other ways. God, my dogs will not stop barking when someone walks by. Now I use a spoon and I just go all the way in scraping the bottom to get it out. And I find that very effective. But another way you can do that I learned from a fellow at home chef is when it's like this, you just slice this part in half, right? And now look, you can just peel that back. Just peel that back and now you have a perfect little segment. Perfect little segment, or you could use the spoon. But I like to use my fingers, don't worry, I washed my hands before I did this. Bunch of different ways to open an avocado. My hands are not bloody and disgusting. So please everybody, take my avocado advice. Don't cut your hand open, Shoshana's in a lot of pain. And I feel bad for her. We were texting all last night and she was hurting. It's no fun to go to the emergency room to get stitches and emergency rooms are really, really busy right now. So no more avocado hand injuries until the coronavirus is done. Feel better, Shoshi. I love you. Take care, everybody.